like I said, I can't do music anymore because I feel like I need you guys to be able to see this on my mobile. And it turns out when I do, you can't. So, um, my karaoke skills are going to have to be put to hold for a minute because I know how much you love my Whitney Houston voice. <laughs> Just kidding. And I think you can see my bra. Oh. Anyway, so what to talk to you about. So, I guess I'm PMSing because I'm crying over everything. Like, I'm still sad Opie died on Sons of Anarchy. Like, oh my god. But it's the little things that, like, my brother was picking on me yesterday and I just started crying. Like, I'm just PMSing. I feel like weight loss has made my PMS so much worse. Um, but, what I want to talk to you about is... I'm on a domestic violence kick, I know I already told you about that, um, but I do want to talk to you guys about, just pretty much, break the cycle. If you have kids, I don't have kids, and you know, someday I hope to have like three to four kids and a little army, um, and a good, good man who's going to be like, yeah, we're going to have like our fourth kid, man, and not complain about it, but um, you have to break the cycle. If your parents did it to you, don't do it to others, is how I'm seeing it. And that's with verbal abuse, mental abuse, and physical abuse. There has to be an end to the cycle. There has to be enough is enough. And um, I can't imagine doing what was did to me to my kids. I can't fathom doing that. And I don't do that to anybody else. I mean... I talk about this op openly because I really want you guys to know there's more to Stephanie than weight loss. There's more to Stephanie than a domestic violence ex. There's more to Stephanie than kookiness, you know what I mean? And yeah, my scars are pretty deep, but at the end of the day, I feel like if I'm not real with you guys, then who is Stephanie? Like, I'm going to tell you how, to, how it is. When I was little, I was abused. Like, there you go. And, um, but you know, there came a point this week last week, where I'm like, you know what, the cycle has to stop, has to, and I never did do the cycle, so I guess at an early age, I did learn the difference between right and wrong when it came to verbal abuse and mental abuse and physical abuse, I'm not physical confrontation, I'm not mental, I'm not even verbal, at this point, I don't get my hands dirty, and I realize some women are just a product of their parents. I mean, that's how they grew up. There's a key factor. Um, this woman who I was friends with is still bashing me on Instagram. And I'm like, who taught her that? Who taught her how to be like that? Society? No. She can pretty much, you know, change if she wants to. Society isn't all like that. But her parents, like, it starts with the parents. You know what I mean? Like, just... I'm this, that, and this. I know I'm not perfect. I don't claim to be perfect. Sometimes I just don't like people. And that's okay. <laughs> Sometimes they don't like me, and that's okay. But I'm not going to go around verbally, mentally, or bullying somebody because it was done to me. You do what you know at the end of the day, right? But there has to come a time where you stop the cycle. And again, I can't stress that enough. If you don't like the way you're being treated, don't treat others like that. There's break the cycle. So I guess that's what I wanted to talk to you guys about. Bye, guys.